It's been a long time coming from the SC Sakalana, baby. Sometimes it feels like the world is against me. Cause I'm coming from SC. From heartache and pain, struggle and strain. Trying to maintain for the SC. So, mama, don't worry. Hey, I'ma make my dreams happen. Question of the day The subcutaneous tissue is a fatty layer found below the dermis, which is also called blank tissue. A. Derma. B. Adipose. C. Coromium. D. Cutis. Answer will be revealed at the end of the video. Alright guys, so it's time for our shout out praise break. I want to give a shout out to these four amazing subscribers. Miss Maria's Nails Bar. Guys, Miss Maria is new to YouTube, so go over and check her out. Miss L Neil2800. Row left. And Adelie OMB. Thank you guys for being the first four to come in on my last video and having your post notification bells turned on. Hi guys, welcome, welcome back to the Nail Genie SC. How are you? I hope you are well and your family is doing well. Do me a favor if you don't mind. If this is your first time visiting the channel, consider subscribing. And if you've been here with me and are returning, I want to welcome you back. Thank you for coming back. And go ahead and hit that like button for me. It helps out the channel a great deal and help pushes our content out to many more amazing subscribers such as yourself. All right, guys. So I know this is very unusual for me. Usually I don't jump right into the design portion of the video, but I was having some issues with the first part of the footage so I had to just erase it completely um, so I owe you guys an application process okay all right so this is our Gemini uh, month or we passed it by a day um, so guys I'm going to just talk about a few fun facts of our Gemini's and want to wish all our Gemini's a very blessed birthday year and hope you had a awesome amazing year and wishing you many many more birthdays to come okay so the gemini dates start at may 21st to june 20th and of course guys you know today is the 21st so i missed posting this video by one day but it's okay because i'm still going to get it out so it says spontaneous playful and adorable erratic Gemini is driven by its insatiable curiosity. Alright, so what kind of person is a Gemini? Playful and intellectually curious, Gemini is constantly juggling, juggling a variety of passions, hobbies, careers, and friend groups. They are the social butterflies of the Zodiac. These quick-witted Twins can talk to anyone about anything. Find them buzzing between happy hours, dinner parties, and dance floors. Sound like a good time. <laughs> Alright, so what is a 
Gemini soulmate. So it says, energetic fire signs, Leo, Sagittarius, and Aries are all super compatible with Gemini. Satisfying Gemini's love of adventure, excitement, and fun. Fellow air signs, Aquarius and Libra, are compatible with Gemini. All three signs are intellectual, communicative, and very social. Okay. All right, it says, um, let's see. What makes a Gemini happy? However... Their restless nature can sometimes make it difficult for them to relax and find inner calm, change, and variety. Gemini people thrive on change and variety. They enjoy trying new things, exploring different interests, and meeting new people. Alright, it says, let's see. Who is Gemini's twin flame. In astrology, there is a belief that the following are complementary twin flame zodiac signs. Aries and Libra, Libra, I'm sorry, Aries and Libra, Taurus and Scorpio, Gemini and Sagittarius. All right, I didn't know that. Hmm, so I'm a twin sign to the Taurus. Okay. Is Gemini's loyal in relationship? All right, let's get to the good part. <laughs> so, guys, here I'm just showing you. I'm using a um, jury tool to p put a hole in the nail so I could put the um, jump ring through and I could attach this Gemini um, charm to this uh, jump ring so it can dangle because the charm is actually too big for the nails so I want it to still have a, the representation of my Gemini so I'm just going to use it as a dangle okay all right Gemini wants a partner in crime someone with whom they can laugh and hustle once they commit You'll find that Gemini's is extremely loyal as long as you respond to their texts, calls, and emails in a timely manner. <laughs> so don't play with Gemini's. Alright, so it says, do Gemini's get moody? So it says, the twin-headed zodiac sign is well known for its two distant personalities, which end up explaining its dramatic mood swings. If you know a Gemini, you must have noticed how they go from chilling and having the time of their lives to sobbing on the floor over a childhood crush. I'm sorry, guys. It's like I got allergies. All right, so let's look at the color, um, Gemini's colors. So, guys, I created this mix that's on the hand, and all of that was in the um, all of that was in the first part of the video that I had to erase. So, I did create this mix by hand. It has beautiful blue in it, yellow, orange, and white. And these are the colors of some of the crystals that is around the Gemini, right? So their favorite color is white and green or, and no, their favorite color is yellow, but their birthstone color is pearl and emerald. So the first part of Gemini is the emerald and the second part of Gemini is the pearl. Okay. So it says yellow is the best color for Gemini is yellow. This cheerful hue is associated with friendliness, optimism, and intellect, with one some, which are some of Gemini's most notable traits. Energetic orange, expansive blue, and fresh green are also in the Gemini color palette. So, when I was creating this uh, mix, I looked at the crystals of Gemini, and it gave me 
um, those colors. So I said, well, let me create a mix. And so I actually put it with a, like, a muted white, whitish yellow um, acrylic. And it come out this gorgeous, gorgeous color here that I thought was absolutely, absolutely amazing for the Gemini. So, guys, I can't wait till you all see the final results of these. They are absolutely gorgeous. This set was really created just simple. But I thought creating it simple was going to be best. Alright, so I wanted to represent the twins by trying to do the uh, smile line on the two fingers in the center. Which is my middle and my ring. Um, that was my way of representing the twins. But, yes, guys, I always try to think about what I want to do with each set and how I want to do it. Um, usually, I'll do some type of drawing, but I've been trying to keep it simple and just use nice charms and beautiful, uh, you know, um, things to add to the nail. So, yeah. All right, guys, so what signs do Geminis attract? Generally, the most compatible signs for Gemini friendships and romantic relationships are fellow air signs, Aquarius, and Libra, as they'll have an innate understanding of Gemini's mental nature. Fire signs, Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius are similarly energetic and can match well with our Gemini friends. Okay, it says, do Geminis fall in love easily? They can fall in love quickly only, only when they meet someone who can match their intelligence. However, keeping a Gemini in love is quite a task. And if they get bored or stop being mentally stimulated, they can fall out of love as quickly as they fell in love. Listen up, listen up if you get you a Gemini. You better know how to treat them. Now, guys, all of this is Google related, okay? It's all in fun. If this is, this may or may not have some specifics to a Gemini. So, if you have a Gemini in your life and you notice some of these things, then okay. But if you are a Gemini and this is not you, then leave me a comment down in the comment section below. Tell me what parts of this could possibly be you and what parts of this is not you okay <laughs> what is gemini's worst match worst love match is pisces pisces need for emotional depth could be incredibly overwhelming for gemini and gemini's love for variety could trigger feelings of neglect in pisces Okay, so Pisces and Gemini, not a good match. Okay. <laughs> All right, so it says, what is Gemini's favorite season? Hmm. So, Gemini, you are considered to be the social butterfly among all zodiac signs, and so you prefer the summer months to be the best time to mingle with others. Makes sense. It's June. <laughs> The, the first day of summer was, what, yesterday? So that makes a lot of sense. All right, give you one more. All right, why are Gem what are Gemini's red flags? Okay, so, or why are Gemini's red flags? It says, Gemini's are social butterflies, but a red flag might be their inconsistency. If they seem indecisive or change their opinions too often, it could create confusion and instability in a relationship. So, yeah. All right, guys. Oh, one more. I'll give you one more. Who is, what is Gemini's favorite food? Now, you could tell me, Gemini's, if this is talking about you, okay? Gemini folks like variety and trying new things. They find happiness in eating Masala dosa, a crispy pancake filled with spiced potatoes, 
usually served with sauces. Hmm. And what do Geminis like to drink? Daiquiri, a cocktail for Geminis. Or keep up with their zest for life makes the twins a perfect match for the versatility of the daiquiri. In a silly, goofy mood, try a bright pink strawberry daiquiri. I love the daiquiri. When I used to drink, I used to, that's my drink. One of my drinks, I'm going to say one of them. But I don't drink anymore, so. Been a long time. Alright, guys. So, I'm sorry that this video was so short. Usually, I try to do the um, application and everything with the video. But, of course, like I said, we had some technical difficulties. And in order for me to be able to get at least a little bit of this video out to you guys and celebrate our Geminis, I just went ahead and, and gave the best footage that I had, okay? So I do apologize um, that I cut you guys short Geminis, but like I said, I wish you all nothing but the best and hope you have an amazing rest of your year. I hope this year's celebration for you was absolutely amazing and go out and be your social butterfly self, all right? I want to thank you all for the support to my channel. I truly appreciate you all so very much. If you are here and have not subscribed, go ahead if you would and hit that subscribe button. I would love to have you a part of my YouTube family as well as on my YouTube journey with me. Okay? I want to thank you all so much, so much for watching. Don't forget to comment, like, share, and subscribe. Follow me over on all of my socials at the Nail Genie SC. And guys, I am trying to grow my Instagram channel. So if you follow me over here and you have Instagram and not follow me over there, do me a favor. Follow me over there. <laughs> all right. So on this um, ring finger, I'm going to put some pearls and some emerald stones on this um, ring finger to bring everything together for our Gemini series, okay? I hope you guys love the set just as much as I enjoyed making it. Um, yeah, and leave me some comments down in the description box below. Tell me what you think about this acrylic mitts that I created. Tell me, Geminis, what you think about all of the little fun facts that we shared. And also tell me if you, Gemini, would wear this set for any anytime but tell me if you wear this set now i know everybody don't cater to duckies but i swear this set is just absolutely gorgeous i mean it was really 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 beautiful and i would wear it but of course i created it <laughs> all right guys so i'm gonna let you go here and yeah the answer to the question of the day will be coming up shortly um, after the next clip and I hope to see you all in my next video have an amazing weekend everybody and I will see you all next time the deuces are flying in the air you already know what time it is poof the nail genie she's out <laughs>